Hey co friends, I'm Beyond Grenade and you're watching Beyond Grenade today. And today, as you can see, I'm at the salon about to get my hair did. Today's video is sponsored by Style C, which is an app that makes it super easy to book professionals, get your hair done, makeup done, nails done, whatever you need to do. But as some of you may know, I am going to Costa Rica this week, so when I go on vacation, my curls go on vacation as well. So I'm gonna do faux locks for the first time. We're gonna do a crochet <laughs> situation. Uh, we will see how that's done. This is all new to me and I'm so excited to see how it looks. So let's get started. So we just have to blow dry my hair because I meant to stretch it before I got here, but I ran out of time and just forgot. So I washed my hair at 1 a.m. last night. So it's still a little wet. So now that we are all blow dried, what are we doing next? Okay, so what I'll be doing right now is braiding up Bianca's hair. Um, the braid pattern is gonna be straightforward. I'm gonna do a how about 10 braids so five on each side going straight back and then i'll do the same to the other half of her hair going straight back so i'm gonna try to get all this long beautiful hair <laughs> all tucked in so that we can do the crochet and yeah i'm excited so i just finished braiding bianca's hair straight back as far as the front and i also decided to connect her middle braids and use it as an anchor braid going to the side. So I really enjoy doing this method because a lot of times when you install crochet braids and just do your hair straight back, you can have opening and spaces where eventually when it starts to grow out that you can tell that there's hair missing there. If you don't put too many braids, then it's not gonna be as full. So I enjoy doing the anchor braids going down so that when I attach the crochet hair, um, there's some braids that are able to hold it going back. Kamara continues to braid my hair, let me tell you how I got here using the app called Style C. It makes it so easy and convenient to find and book a hairstylist, makeup artist, lashes, nails, whatever you're looking for to get beautiful. So first when you open the app, you can see all the different categories. I'm gonna click braids and you could see all the local hairstylists in your area. You could see their work, their photos, their pricing and availability. Or if you already know the stylist you wanna work with, you could just type in their name and go to their page. I'm going to type in Kamara Brown for her salon Raw Intuition. And this time I'm gonna look for crochet faux locks. I see it right here, I can see the price, I could see how many bundles I need and how long it's gonna take. Once I click on my style, it opens up her calendar and I can see her availability, click on the date, click on the time, and just like that, I booked an appointment without even having to talk to anybody. Once you book, you have the address saved in the app. It'll give you a little reminder when it's time for your appointment. And it's just so easy. So if you're looking to get your hair done anytime soon and can't find a stylist in your area, download Style Seat right now. It's free to do so, and it's going to make your life so much easier. I just finished cornrolling Bianca's hair from front to back. This is how the back looks. Her hair is very long, so what I did was um, take the end braid and just kind of crochet it through her hair. So that way it's all nice and tucked in and there's no actual hair that's out. And this install is going to be really nice. It should last her at least about a month and a half to two months. So here's the hair that I chose. I actually got this on Amazon. I've never purchased hair from Amazon besides my little like clip on ponytails. So I will link all this in the description box. This is called... Carita Faux Locks Crochet Hair. This is 24 inches. Uh, I guess there's six pieces in each. And yeah, I got two packs or two orders of, so we have eight bundles, I yeah. believe. Eight bundles in total. Let's see how many we use. So right now I'm taking the crochet faux locks hair and using a latch hook to install the hair to her braids. So this is the first one. I like to start at the bottom and work my way up top. So I'm gonna open up the, the latch hook. This is what it looks like. And you're gonna stick the latch hook. I like to do it as close to the front of the hairline so that when the hair is installed, it looks really nice and um, secure. And I'm gonna close it, pull it through, and also use that same latch hook 
to do the ends of the hair, close it, and pull it out. So this is what you should have by the end of it. Like that. Oh, that's pretty easy. Yeah. How does that feel? I might be able to do this one day. <laughs> <laughs> that feels great. Yeah, so I um, like to make sure that it's just as close to the hairline so that once it's nice and full and, and done, it just kind of looks like individual braids and not, you know, crochet starting further back so cool try to get it as close to the front of the hairline as you can without causing breakage or tension you don't want to pull too much one down <laughs> 200 to go <laughs> so what do i do maintenance wise maintenance wise you just need to make sure that you continue to oil your scalp um as often as at least three days a, a week mm -hmm. um i like to do it at my time so that okay. you know you don't have to worry about any oils running or anything uh, throughout the day or in the morning. Okay. You're gonna also sleep with a bonnet okay. cap. It's very important to protect the crochet hair. Even though it's not your hair, you also wanna make sure that you get the longevity out of it mm -hmm. without causing too much frizz early on. So sleeping with a bonnet or a silk pillowcase will be very good for this style right. but it's it's super low maintenance you know? i guess with washing since this isn't my hair it's more about just my cleansing my scalp yes so using dry shampoos are very important any shampoo spray that you know you enjoy using on your scalp you can use okay. just as long as it doesn't require you to truly have to rinse it out yeah you can just use like a cloth just kind of massage your scalp to get all the the build up off of it mm -hmm and you can put your oils back in. Okay. Especially for the front of your hair. So, you know, if you wanna use edge control for baby hair, mm -hmm. definitely make sure at least once a week that you're taking off that edge control mm -hmm. so that you can reapply it and you're not building up on your product. Halfway done and we're moving quickly. So we are almost complete. Um, we have one more section left and that's what I was speaking of earlier about the anchor braids going to the side. I like to make sure that it's full. I know sometimes people do not want that much hair in their head, but when it comes to locks and twists and any of these type of crochet style, over time, the longer you wanna wear it, the, the more your hair will start spreading and you may have some braids that are gonna be shown in between. So to avoid that, you might as well just make sure your hair is nice, neat, and compact in the beginning so that as it grows out, you still won't be able to see any braids or have any, um, any crochet area showing. And this is the last crochet. We used eight packs. Um, exactly. Yeah, <laughs> exactly eight packs. In the packaging, it came with six. So we needed two bundles of the pack. So uh, Bianca has some more left over in case she wants to keep filling it in, but we're good. A <laughs> it's a lot of hair. Yeah. So yeah, it looks beautiful. And she's also able to wear it to the side. So she can flip it over to any side that she chooses. You can also pull a few back out of her face. We gotta do some hairstyles now. Yeah. <laughs> got my little jewels. Yeah, and jewels. So it's a really great protective style. It's super easy, super fun, and it's lightweight, right? Yeah. And over time, as she sleeps on it, wears it, the hair is gonna start to relax and it's just gonna be more down here. Mm -hmm. um, right now, this is like fresh right out the package, so it feels very fluffy, but mm -hmm. by the time you wear it for about a week, it's just mm -hmm. gonna feel very natural for you. Okay, cool. So yeah. It's nice. so cute, I love it. Thank you. Mm -hmm. So there you go, the finished look. I'm so ready for my vacation. Once again, make sure you guys download the Style Seat app. It's free. I know it's hard to find stylists if you don't live in California. You can't always do my recommendations. So now you could just download the free app and search in your city. You can find people to do your makeup, your hair, nails, lashes, whatever it is. It makes it super convenient. So now that my time is up for my booking, it's already paid Kamara, so I'm good to go. You could add your extra tip in here. You could book your next one. It just makes everything super 
super convenient. So thank you Style Seeds for sponsoring this video and Kamara for doing my hair. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe. I post new videos every week. You also can follow me on Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter at Ms. Bianca Renee. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching Bianca Renee today. Thank you.